Hi guys, Ross here from Lifestyle Property People. So I'm just in a property that we've recently completed on and um, I just wanted to give you a quick tour around and show you some of the items that we'll be picking up on as part of the refurb. So I'll spin the camera around. I'm just stood in bedroom two, which is on the second floor. As you can see, it looks in quite good condition. Uh, the carpets are in good condition. Although I normally prefer to go for, for something a little bit darker, they are in decent condition. So I'm not, you know, we're not going to bother changing them on this refurb. The walls are generally in good condition. There are a few uh, little marks that need touching up. So we'll be filling them and then painting the walls magnolia. Obviously, it hides a multitude of sins. Does magnolia white shows every little mark on it. So we'll be painting the the insides of the cupboards where they've been painted pink. Going to be putting some stain block on the chimney breast wall. It's quite common to have stains on the chimney breast, so it just needs a bit of stain block. Um, we've had the flashings checked and they're fine. So, yeah, we'll move on. This is just like a little lobby area at the top of the stairs. It's almost a bit of a wasted space, but, um, you know, it's not... It, it doesn't warrant taking this wall down. There's going to be no extra rents. Um, and for the costs of doing that, it's just not worth it. So it's a kind of a bit of a storage area. But it's all in good condition, so there's going to be no extra costs in here. So we'll be replacing this door, um, obviously with the glass there. Um, it's potential hazard. So we'll be replacing that to just a normal wood panel door. So we'll head downstairs. Obviously, the handrails are already, already fitted, sorry. So we don't need to do anything with them. So we're going to bedroom one. Bedroom one's in really good condition. We just need to replace the carpet, really. It's got the blinds fitted and a curtain pole. Excuse me, so we'll be fitting the carpet. We're actually going to leave the walls white in here, I think. There's virtually no marks on the wall or walls so yeah very little work in here just replace the carpet and it'll be perfectly fine for renting out so we'll head on into the bathroom so as you can see another glass door that'll be getting replaced the floor's in good enough condition to leave as it is the tiles generally are okay except for around the bath so we'll be resealing around the sink and the toilet as you can see they're a bit grubby um, same with the bath they'll be getting resealed the tiles around the bath and shower area have been uh, fixed on with silicon instead of tile grout so they'll all be coming off to up to this line everything below there will be coming off and then be refitted the tiles are all quite a modern type of uh, brick tile They'll be getting refitted, regrouted, now looking nice and appealing for potential tenants. And then we'll just be painting the walls and ceiling uh, in white, bathroom and kitchen paint. So yeah, that's the bathroom. We'll head downstairs. As you can see, the, the carpets follow on from upstairs all the way down. We're in good condition. So as you come down, you're into the living room. Again, the living room's in good condition. We're gonna replace the carpet. It's quite dated. Uh, it doesn't look too bad on a video, I don't think, but in person it does look as if um, yeah, it could do with changing. So we're gonna replace that, obviously. This is the first room that you see when you walk in the house of so potential tenants. It needs to have that wow factor. So we're gonna paint the walls magnolia, replace the carpet, and that's pretty much it in here. It's in good condition. So not a bad room. So we'll head on into the kitchen. Again, the third glass door. Um, that'll be getting replaced. We'll be Putting a vinyl floor in, as you can see the damage there. Good use of storage there. Doesn't take up too much space, but plenty of allows for plenty of cupboard space. 
just come around here so you can see the rest of the kitchen. So on the front wall will be sanding and filling just to the side of the boiler and then painting the whole room. I'm going to reseal around the worktops. This is something I always like to do. It, it really does set off the kitchen. But yeah, not a bad, not a bad little kitchen. Plenty of storage. Overall, it's a good house really. Um, there's not a lot of work to do, just um, mostly decorative. Um, so yeah, that's about it really. Um, if you're interested in finding out a bit more about what we do um, as a company or what we do as part of the refurbs, feel free to get in touch with myself or one of the team. We're always happy to help. So that's it. See you soon, guys.